What's up, everyone? It's boy Slim Shiny, and today I'm gonna be doing a video on my reaction of KSI versus Logan Paul face off. Now, if you join the video, make sure you leave a like and subscribe for more. So, let's do this. How'd this come about? How'd this come about, Jimmy? I called him out. Why? Yeah, why did you do that? Yeah, because I was like, I thought I'd save you. Okay. Mm. I in in a, in a way. Career. In, uh, okay. Uh, yeah. Nah, nah. I mean, you have because I'm gonna beat you, and uh, it'll, it'll be great for me. But, but no. Okay. Well, what did you think when he called you out? Um. To did me, you think I, it was a joke? I did. I did. What? Because <laughs> I I just come from a athletic background, and I'm not used to a YouTuber calling me out for something that I'm like really good at. So you kind of insulted. Uh, yeah, at first I thought he was joking. He called, he called uh, Jake out. He called me out. He, any of the pools, he didn't care. And, any of the uh, pools. I, I decided to accept first. I think after I beat you the second time, Jake, Jake's gonna want to kick your ass too if you're down. I'm gonna beat you twice, and then Jake's gonna beat you, you're gonna beat you. and then your career's gonna be done. That's gonna pretty be confident there. Yeah. So, so I'm trying to find out. You, you're insulted, and you're, you're not surprised by his confidence because you just. You beat Walla? You got the job done? Yeah, yeah. I destroyed Walla. What do you think of that? Yeah. You destroyed Walla? I destroyed Walla. <laughs> Look, man. I'm way better right now than I ever was. So I would hope so. Because I'm not I Joe Weller. So. I'm not Joe Weller. I know, so, you know, I think, I think you're... I don't think you realize what you've walked into. No, I, I have. Trust me. I don't think so. I'm very excited. I oh, he knows what you walked into. I'm, I'm punk rock. He knows. So my clout. Your clout? My clout? It's true. No one in America really knew who you were before. Oh, no, people know that. I know, but it's cool. Where's the beef? Boy, where's, boys, where's the... the guy that lost it. Where does the beef come from, originally? Because I, I can cut this out in this video with a nice... The second you walked in the room, where's the beef coming from? What's it all about? I, I think right now it's just uh, part of the ego. I feel like uh, obviously Dogan thinks he's the top dog. And uh, he's not. I'm just gonna... Let you run through you, bro. Is that right? No. No, yeah, that, no, that's not right. Mm. It, he's right, though. It is an ego thing. I have a pretty big ego. He does, too. So at the end of the day, it's just two dudes who are going to... Uh, I think Logan has big ego. But, um, for me, I mean, because we didn't have beef. Mm. We didn't have beef. Then you called me out, and things got a little too personal for me. So How personal? What was it? What was it? A gun in your skin? I don't... I don't I don't want to get into it. You will. You know what it is. You know what it is. Yeah, we don't need to, yeah, need to get into it. He, he knows what it is, but it's 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 certain comments that make me think, oh, this is gonna be like a fun boxing match, and then like when you're falling, I'm gonna make that extra effort. Day. I mean, this for me isn't the end goal. My end goal is. I would to hope not. It's a YouTube boxing match. Yeah. yeah you want to go pro? Go pro. How, you suck. How would you expect to do that? But I don't. How do you know that? Because your match against Joe Weller was embarrassing. I was And when you hit pads, Joe even said, Joe said, he, you don't hit hard. He said, you don't hit hard. Yeah, obviously he's going to say that. I destroyed him, and obviously he doesn't want yeah. to admit that he is the weaker opponent. I, I disagree. I think Joe Weller is a level-headed guy who understands what he got into. And I, I, think, I, don't think, I, think, he, I think he he's choked. He's way over his head. He's way over his head. Out of you two, who do you think has bitten off more than they can chew? Realistically. <clears throat> you called him out. Now he's talking like, what are you doing? Are you mad? Are you mad? No, seriously, I'm like, I'm, I'm sitting here. I love it. And I'm like, I'm like, what are you, like, what are you some kind of crazy person? Are you stupid, bro? Like, I, I wouldn't get in the ring with me. I'm not. I'm, 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 I'm an animal. I'm a yeah. dog, bro. If there were two of me. I'm a god. You're, you're a yeah, god? Yeah, you're an animal. I'm a god. This is what god looks like? <laughs> Jesus Christ, we got some work to do. Yo, why are you talking about my son? <laughs> oh shit, I believe it. This is crazy. Yo, my friends oh, and I were God. talking and it's like we we are impressed at how well you embody this role because at first I saw your movies and not a great actor, but when you sit here and say that stuff, it feels like like it feels like you're starting to believe you can win. Which is like No, I'm serious, like we're we're talking, it's like we're talking, it's like how do you how do you do it? How do you do it for this long in front of so many people? This is called being natural. This is my natural state. Let's talk facts and fiction. 
What's your background in combat? Any form of combat? Yeah, I wrestled. I wrestled uh, for a majority of my life. Um, I did some MMA in, in high school for a couple years. No, no boxing though. Um, I'm just, I'm just an athlete, and I know Joe Weller said he was an athlete too. And I'm look how that turned out. I know, but the kid's not an athlete. Like he's just not. That's that's not how athletes. <clears throat> but and no offense to Joe Weller, but again, bro, I, I'm not Joe Weller. I'm a different beast. Of course, I'm a corn-fed Ohio boy. Mm -hmm. How's your preparation for this been going? It's it's been going, been uh, doing good, good. Mayweather, you trained with Mayweather this camp? Yeah, I, I did for a day. Oh, uh, and then he went. Two right. after I did. Good job. Hmm? Good job. What's your background? Oh, you're one five. What's your background? So I, uh, what's called sport-wise, I have no background. Yeah, literally started boxing. Less than a year ago. Do you not? Do you not find that scary? No. Yeah. Not at all. I know. You see, but wait, hold on. I I have to ask. Mm. You get a six pack, you get some muscles, and then you proclaim that you're God. Okay. What's the logic there? It's called confidence. <laughs> There's a difference between confidence yeah. and saying, "I am God," okay. and Jesus Christ is my Son. Mm -hmm. You. Let me, say, let me tell you from experience, I've seen professional fighters, one gets in with the other, one fighter doesn't respect the credentials of the other fighter because he thinks you don't belong here, this is what I'm hearing from you, this is what I'm hearing in between the lines. And in that fight, this was Carl Froch, George Groves, 80,000 people, they didn't find each other. You know, Carl Froch almost lost, he was the champion, he was the guy that everybody expected to win because he didn't respect his man. What I'm saying is, it sounds like you're not respecting him enough to take him serious enough wouldn't it be funny if he lost then? That pressure. Imagine not bragging wise. That's a lot of pressure. Oh, so are you taking him seriously enough? Yeah, oh, of course. I mean, look, I grew up my whole life watching fights. I understand how fights work. And uh, as much as I can sit here and pretend to not acknowledge JJ as an athlete and a fighter, he can throw hands. I see that. I'm training hard for it. Of course, I, of course I, I respect his ability to box. And I could get caught with anything. It is a fight. So by no means am I walking in 100% I can win. Anything can happen. It's a fight. I just know what I can so do. So you're bad tracking now. What? You're bad tracking. What? Well, you said you were the guy who was going to just run through me. No, you said no. You actually said that. you're bad tracking. You said that. No, you... Can, can we play the clip again? Oh, my God. You, you used your own words. You just quoted yourself. You were bad tracking. It's a size that it can be a problem. He's a high so Just look at Logan Paul. Yeah, he's got, he's got reach. He's got reach. He's, um, he's got an athletic background. Smoke you know, on him. You saw the sparring that you did. Knocked the guy down. Looked pretty good. You know, you've got fast hands. Panic, though. Panic. You threw a lot of hands there. You didn't need to. He wasn't really posing that much of a threat. But you, uh, you threw a lot of hands there. That's going to, I don't know, it's going to tie you out a bit if you're going to throw like that. How are you going to get through the height and the reach? How are you going to negate this win? How are you going to get this? Do you want to knock him out or is it punch? Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm going to knock him out. Really? Yeah, 100%. Hey, yeah. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. He's getting knocked out. And it's going to not be pretty. And you're going to be worried. You're going to be in the fight. And you're going to be like, oh, shit, this is, this this, is real. This is a fight. This is happening. This is a boxing match. Wait, can I, can I handle this guy? No, I can't. I think so. Okay. You're answering I'm yourself gonna... again. Punching. You're literally you have, you're having a conversation. You said Body that shots. in the press conference. Face shots. You're gonna hit me in the face in a boxing match? Constantly. Wait. <laughs> Good idea, man. No, no, you're a fight strategy. You reach the ground. And usually, when you've got yeah. two fighters together, you can sense bullshit. Okay. You know, guys try and create that. That's what I'm saying. I can't. So, I can't with him. So, can you sense any bullshit? Can no. Sense? Like, I feel like he <laughs> believes himself. That's why I'm impressed. This is this is. If confidence. Well, like everyone here is like. Amazed that you can sit here and say these things, and it's great. Like, I'm happy for you. I, 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 think, it's, I think it's interesting that, like, throughout this whole interview, you're literally looking everywhere but my eyes. I just like to be honest. To be honest with you, I'm kind of done with the talk and the bullshit. Because let's be honest, like, oh, Logan. <laughs> oh, Logan. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna make that my ringtone. Um. Let's be honest, the only thing that matters is August 25th. I don't like this, do you? 
Not really. I kind of just want to kick the shit out of you. Yeah. I don't know why we're here. Like, I just like it's hard to just sit here in front of you. You're scared. Okay. You're That's scared so you're gonna get in the ring, find an emotion, tactics. Emotion. When you're gonna get in, find an emotion. Oh, you're gonna no, get, no, 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 I was applying. Play until they get hit in the face. Oh, yeah. You're predictable. That's that's bad for you. Bro. Tell me round one. Tell me to as far as the fight goes, talk me through the fight. From your point of view. I'm coming to you too. Yeah, of um, I want to give the fans a show. I'm a showman. Round one, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to feel you out, but at the same time, I think I'm going to hit you with a couple shots that make you realize tr truly what you've accidentally walked into because again i think you're caught in like youtube land this is the big boys game now. This, this is the big boys game now bro when you get hit in the face it's hard harder than you've ever been hit before in sparring for six years and you just got your first youtube red show bro congratulations it's your big day that's round one have we, got, have we got two in the fight huh that's round one have we knocked him out yet no co my coach wants me to but i don't i don't i feel like you can't Okay, uh, I feel like if we go past round one, it'll be a bit better of a show. So I think uh, round two is a bit of a is a bit of a show, and then round three is the knockout. That's what. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. Judge Round one. Uh, body shots. Lots and lots of body shots. My aim for that body, man. It's open. It's always open. How do you know that? Yeah. Just when you're sparring. My 18 second sparring tape that no I up. taped a month ago. It should no up, bro. Round two. Uh, I might increase the pace. In fact, I probably will. Just increase it, just a bit, just a tad. See how you do. See if you can uh, chill in boiling hot water. And then round three. This is when I really hope in. This is where the shots get more powerful. It's where the energy just soars through my veins. And that's when you... When you talk, it sounds like a we worry. Dragon Ball Z character, but I can't get over this. Like, this yeah, is... Round four. Do you, do you write this down? Do you, write the, do you write these things down? I finish you off and end your career. So I feel like where... you believe yourself. That's why I can... I, I envy your ignorance. I really do. I wish I... I wish... In a way, I... I sort of have that, but... It's 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 really it's crazy, bro. And I'm I'm happy for you, bro. A lot of visiting, bro. Fidgeting? Mm. Uh, I mean, I'm times a bit nervous. Really nervous. I just it's again it's hard for me to sit here. It's a quivering. Don't think so. But astute observation there, Sherlock. I just like I would love to. I I didn't really want to do this. I figured it'd be good. I don't really know why I'm here. I just I kind of want to beat the shit out of you. And that's all that matters. August 25th is all, all, all that matters. It's gonna be like, it's gonna be like, it might as well be December 25th. Do you guys it's know? It's gonna be Christmas for me, like straight up. Do you guys know how big this is? Because you have professional fighters, top tier fighters that want this kind of audience. Gotta be watching this. I'm interested. In my personal opinion, I think eyes on this. You're talking like a hundred million around the world. That's my view. It's pretty good. Now this, the, the biggest viewing figures were Mayweather and McGregor. Everybody watch that. Yeah. These are the kind of clouds that you're gonna attract. Is that pressure you can handle? Can you deal with this? I know he can. Yeah. Where does the loser go? Where's the loser go? Bragging rights are there. Everybody sees it. Yeah, man. I I don't think. Like, I I I do want to establish one thing. I don't think. I don't think any of us are losers. I think we're both winners. Like I said, I, I respect him as a fighter and an athlete. He works hard. I work hard. It's going to be a phenomenal fight. The problem is, you're going to get the loser's going to get bitched on every time he walks in the street. They're going to talk about the fight. Say you got your ass. It's going to suck for you. That's why I'm saying, like, good for you, bro. Live whatever you're feeling now. Live in it. Soak it up. Cause it's going to become a meme. And it's going to be hilarious. I'm already, a, I'm already a meme a lot. A meme even more. Really, more than your bandana. To be honest, part of the reason I came here, I was wondering if you take it off for us. I can't. I'm, I'm good. What's under it? I mean, you've seen what's under it. I, I don't know, bro. I feel well, like you how long have you had that one on? on the picture. How long have you had that? Have, have that? Had that one? I had no bandana on. How long have you had that one on? For like, uh, this one's new, actually. Good for this you. Is, uh, I'm happy one. for you, bro. <laughs> Simon bandana. We're releasing this one. Too. That's amazing. I'm, I'm I'm proud of you, dude. That's a big Not step up. Yeah, that's good. Can you just tell me what's under it? What, you what is it? Fountain of Youth. 
my puppy. I lost him this right. afternoon. Can you just take it off, bro? Just take it off. Just take off the bandana, bro. <laughs> Well, he Walsh. never takes it off, bro. What's wrong with it? I don't know. How can someone wear the same thing every single day? How do you do that? I'm just kidding. Just say it. Are you changing the subject? <laughs> I'm not changing the subject. I'm talking about it. Kinda sounds like you are. Kinda sounds like you're changing the subject a little bit. Why don't you want to look into my eyes? I will. I just, I, again, I don't really know why I'm here, bro. It's all that matters is August 25th. Why are you repeating yourself? <laughs> you asked me a Answer question. my question. <laughs> Yo, what is, what's your question? I'm just kidding. No, no absolutely not. Okay, so boys. Let's see how this goes. Oh, you, will we possibly get a handshake between you? Fuck no! Hell no! Because yeah, you talk shit about me. You talk shit about my family. You talk shit about my girl. Ooh. Come on, bro. Put that hand back. <laughs> Put that hand back, bro. I will shake your hand when you're That's on the ground and back. I help you up. And then I will shake your hand. I will give you the firmest handshake of your life. Okay. And I will get. I will personally get your bandana for you and put it on your head. Okay. But until then, bro. I gotta keep it, I gotta keep it 100 with you. It's not gonna happen. I'm in your head. I think we have a problem. I think so. I think so, too. I think so, I think so too. <gasps> Check the links in the description. If you can't make it to Manchester to purchase this fight, it is gonna be one hell of a fight. If you can make the fight, go to KSI v Logan. Wow. He's pretty confident. But kind of tense right there but I'm still going for KS, KSI all the way alright guys if you enjoyed the video make sure you leave a like and subscribe and comment below who do you think will win KSI or Logan Paul until next time see ya